Well, thank you so much for your time this morning, Dakota. It's a privilege and a pleasure to see you again. Likewise. How are you doing this morning? I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? Uh, just terrific. And it's uh, always an uh, uh, exciting time when I get to talk with you. Oh. Um, congratulations nice. on such a deep, touching, move, moving, funny, exhilarating, and horrific story all at once. Yeah. Um, as a as a son whose mom passed away of cancer, this really struck me. I mean, I couldn't hold back the tears. This is such a beautifully told story. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry about your mom. Oh, that's it's been a long time, but it certainly brought back uh, a, a lot of the memories. So, tell me, how did you how did you get the role? Did you audition for this? Did they come to you and say we want you to play this part? Yeah, Gabriella sent me the script and then I had a meeting with her and I loved her. And um, it, it, yeah, that's how that happened. You're surrounded by pretty terrific uh, people, both in Casey Affleck and Jason Siegel, who bring such, you know, different characters to this story. Um, and that was so refreshing because you're, you're, you're getting kind of all these sides to, um, you know, what happens when somebody does, you know, is pronounced with cancer. Yes. Yeah. I think, um, there's no, uh, rule book for this type of thing. And the way that life happens is it, you know, reality goes into every, every possibility. So it's tragic and it's horrifying and it's grotesque and it's grueling and it's funny and it's sweet and it's loving. And um, I think that's what we, that's what I found to be beautiful about the script and, and this movie. Yeah, and I love the way that it's told in, in, in you know, in kind of a non-linear way because that's how we remember life, you know, we, we, we don't just go back to a certain point and start, we go all over. Yeah. Yeah. There's no, there's no, there's no rule book. <laughs> you must be very proud to be in a movie that, that will touch so many people. I'm, I'm so proud. I'm, um, I feel very fortunate to be a part of this project. Uh, was it a difficult shoot for you? It was tricky. Yeah, it was, you know, there were some really heavy moments, but we were surrounded by such lovely people and everyone genuinely cared for each other. So, so it was really um, a good, it was a good experience. What do you think audiences are going to pull out of the film? I think that it's a story that many people can resonate with. Um, if they've ever lost someone or been ill themselves or had a friend that's remarkable or you know right now the feeling the energy of immense loss is everywhere in the world whether you've lost loved ones or your job or your home or um, your day-to-day -day life <laughs> it's it's everywhere and and perhaps maybe this movie will remind people to find some joy in, in love. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time and, and you have a great afternoon. Thank you, you too.